Now, KOAT, Action 7 News, live at 10. Coverage you can count on. Time is up for the homeless camping in the Albuquerque Borellis neighborhood. Tonight is the deadline for their eviction notice, but there's still no permanent place for them to go. Joy Junction, the state's largest homeless shelter, says a plan is needed to address drug addiction, alcoholism, and mental illness among the homeless. The situation was a hot topic at tonight's city council meeting. An Action 7 News reporter Laura Train was there as dozens of people got up to speak. Some are calling this a crisis. She joins us now live with how that debate went. Shelly, right now the city is in limbo. We have homeless people on the streets, in parks, and in a private lot. And while some city officials want to take care of the problem immediately, others are looking for a long-term solution. Give us a piece of dirt. We'll handle it. Speaker after speaker after speaker got up to the podium Wednesday and begged city council to fix Albuquerque's homeless problem. This city is spending money to destroy the Bosque while people are homeless and starving. The city has a lot on its plate with this issue. People are living on the streets, in parks, even in a tent city on a private lot at Santa Fe and First. While the city's chief of staff has said he wants to get these people help, there is no law that forces the homeless to go to shelters. We are in a crisis situation and we need to work together in collaboration. City Councilor Ken Sanchez suggested solutions like housing these people in an old jail, raising taxes, or creating more affordable housing. But there was no vote or decision made by City Council and tonight there are still several people living here in Tent City. A sign posted by the lot's owner over the weekend said the homeless had three days to leave. Now that piece of paper is gone in its place an official city sign reading no trespassing. Many argue even if Tent City is cleared these people will just find another place to camp and the problem won't be solved. So again, no vote on the homeless issue tonight. It's unclear if the council will come up with legislation to deal with it. Live at City Hall, Laura Terrain, KOAT Action 7 News.